Hey guys, it's James again with the latest update of Modio giving us an editor for both Just Cause 2 and Red Dead Redemption. Uh, today I'm going to quickly show you how to use the editor for Red Dead Redemption. And I believe the editor works for the original Red Dead Redemption and the DLC and standalone version of Undead Nightmare because they have the same multiplayer. So the first thing you want to do is have your save game on your device, whether it be a hard drive or a USB. As you can see here is my pre-modded save of the... Red Dead Redemption save with everything at almost minimum because I've basically just begun playing for the first time. Once you've saved and transferred your save to your USB, open Modio 5 and sign in in the top right. To access your save, click open a save. Select USB stick and it should take you to the option of Red Dead Redemption. Once it's there, click and you'll be given three buttons. Click the one that's labeled multiplayer, then go to the third tab on the left that says modify save. From this point it's up to you on what you want to mod in your save. You can choose from up to 38 different horses, change your experience, you can even unlock all gold weapons that you have already. Once you're done choosing what you want, click save changes and exit Modio 5. Then at last, put your USB or hard drive back into your Xbox and load up the multiplayer. It'll be there with everything you've chosen and you won't have to have a problem with killing just about anyone. I like that the developers gone back on the old games just because it shows that they might be old but they're still amazing games. In fact, Red Dead Redemption actually got a 9.8 in Australia from IGN, and the DLC of Undead Nightmare got a 10 out of 10. Well, that was just because there were zombies. Gotta love zombies. Anyway, as you can see here are the things I modified, and with an undead horse and a golden pistol and knife, it's a lot of fun and I'm sure you'll be at that point soon. So, hope you guys enjoyed the video and this amazing new editor. If there's a tutorial you want to see in the future, just click the annotated text above and it'll take you straight to the thread for you to let me know. I'm James and I'll see you next time.